welcome all my universal brothers and sisters today we are suffering so many problem in our stomach inside abdominal pain hernia and uh, sometimes some pain is developed too much and doctor has to be operated there is no solution but by this some physical breathing exercise we can cure it and we can give the solution what is the problem normally this navel navel is a very important part in our life and which is our spiritual way we used to say kula kundalini why we used to say kula kundalini because when we born in mother's womb first cell of our life which has given our total body that first cell of life is living in the navel which is connected directly through the cosmos so this part navel part is a very important part for the, all the organs and all the part of our body if navel will be disbalanced then we cannot think properly we cannot listen properly we can look properly we nothing can be done our hand leg nothing can be work properly so this navel part is very important how it is disbalancing navel is normally it is the center and it can little bit tighter left side right side upper side lower side all the four corner side it can shift due to the different organ weakness so when which part of organ is weak then they will pull to navel other side so opposite side will get the pain it is a short so it will be get pain so doctor will say is a hernia or it is appendix or something we have to cut cut it out still we didn't get the solution because of actually it is not in hernia not in appendix not in abdominal pain due to the navel shifting we are having the pain and how it could be solved it's a very simple method we can see one two three four line in our hand from here so same one two three four line so first we have to join in our this down line together one way then we have to be mix it like that you see now it is a both four line are equal means 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 4 all four line is equal so it is it is the normal condition but some patient it could happen then why no will make it it could like that means then right side is down and right side is down that means left side is small so that's why its right side is down so we have to be pull balance it here so when it make it enlarge so then it will be come on right way it is it need some time other self but it is a very simple process we can do in our self so we say suppose it is no, normally it is my normal but it can support it like that red uh, right side is small then what we have to do left hand put it there and right hand make it tight and thumb is like that and make it directly spontaneously that make it tight when it will touch to the our shoulder then three four times when will do and then it will come in right direction so if left hand is short so we have to we do for the left hand like that so when we are making force fully and then it will be come on line so when it will come on line then navel is the first cell of our life so all organ will come to on line and on balance so this is the is our one process and another way breathing exercise how we can balance it sadhisthan chakra and muladhara chakra manipur chakra and anahata chakra that four chakra is very important to controlling the navel part so simple technique we can make it just stand comfortable and that uh, breathe in then our anus and urinary place we have to be soaked inside means squeeze inside and breathe out then relax release so like that i'll it cannot be showing outside 
So we you can do your side. So breathe in. This way, several times we have to do. At least 36 times so we have to do. When we will do the 36 time, then our Mulaka Chakras and Sadhisthan Chakras will balance in the fixed in the right position. Mulaka Chakras and Sadhisthan Chakras is a very important chakras which is controlling our sexual organs and our all the reproductive organs. So, which is imbalance and then it will be it is a power supply of our body and then others organ will be very easily imbalanced. So that's why first we have to balance Mulata Chakra and Sadhisthan Chakra. Next, that is a very simple technique we can balance in our navel chakras through the breathing exercise. So keep on left hand on the navel and right hand up. Then breathe in, then make it stomach outside and breathe out go as much as possible inside. Breathing is a very important part which is creating the disease and which is curing disease also. When you have breathe in, stomach is going outside that means maximum oxygen we are taking and when breathe out, stomach is going outside that means maximum carbon dioxide we are leaving. So maximum oxygen is going inside cleansing the organ and carbon dioxide toxins are coming out so we are become healthy. But when we are breathe in, stomach is going inside, that means maximum oxygen we cannot, less oxygen we are taking. And breathe out, stomach is going outside, then maximum carbon dioxide staying inside, not able to come out. So that's why we are creating our disease through the wrong breathing. So we have to very much careful breathe. So breathing is a, our medicine and which can give all the solution. So how we can make it? Very easy. Left hand keep on in navel, right hand up, breathe in, stomach out, breathe out, so several times we have to do at least 36 time in same time so breathe in when stomach is going outside and breathe out stomach is going inside then our navel chakras is where it was seated it is coming back on the same position then we are getting all the balance of the chakras and all the organs balance we are getting through the navel chakras because it is the first cell of our life which is connected with the all the organs and all the cells so next, there is a little bit another some technique you are there. Means breathe in time, three, three step we will take breathe in and two step breathe out. Means like that. So breathe in longer time means long time oxygen we are taking. Oxygen get time to cleanse the toxins and breathe out short time means quickly leaving the toxins so that's why this is the ratio and when we are breathing we have to breathe in full lungs lungs will be complete and breathe out complete stop the lungs so then maximum oxygen we can take and less uh, your maximum carbon dioxide we can leave so that simple technique we have to follow now it could balance another it's, uh, it's a very important which is the Anahata Chakras which is the center of the all the chakras of our body which is balancing the, all the chakras. So Anahata Chakra will be give us balancing navel and our those are having that asthmatic patient, long asthmatic patient and it is very very great help for them. So how we have to do same technique in the navel, left hand in the Anahata Chakras, this is called, this is the place is Anahata Chakras. So, all the diaphragm here is the end, this is the Anahata Chakra. So, we can put it left hand there and right hand up, 
same way breathing chest will be outside breathe out chest will be go inside so same way we can do several time at least 36 time we can do same time when we are doing and then our Mulaga chakras, Sadhisthan chakras, Manipu chakras and Anahata chakras got balanced then other the positive chakras automatically it is naturally it is balanced and it will help to us so thank you thank you thank you thank you very much